Good morning! I just realized how pale I actually look. I blame the camera settings. <laughs> Good morning, people! It is a beautiful morning. Today, Kiri is arriving. If Kiri is filming, you guys are probably going to see her. You're probably going to see her anyway on my channel. Let's take the Denise Lin, the sacred traveler. Also, if you want to see what we are up to today, follow my vlog channel. Also, in June, I'm going to London. My God, am I excited? Yes. So, it's four days of London's fun with Eben. I don't know if you guys have actually met Eben on this channel, but you have met Eben on my vlog channel. Maybe Kiri is even going to join us. We will see. All right, so. What do we actually have today? Tuesday? Magical Tuesday. We have two cards. We jumped out. Unknown territory. We have got that one before. And navigating by the stars. Two different scenarios, right? Scenery, entities, going from one thing to another, being on a journey. Something feels like unknown territory. And normally we are being guided by the road ahead. But in your case, you're being guided by the stars. Pay attention to the night. Yes, there might be a lot of signs for you. There is new moon energy here. Pay attention to owls, birds, because we do have a owl and a bird here. Even if the pathway feels a little oof, a little cold, you're going in the right direction. Remember, Mercury retrograde can confuse us. I did that when I had to book tickets. <laughs> I did oops. I saw there was a new way of paying with the phone, with an app, a Danish app. And I was talking over the phone while I did it, which don't do that. Don't multitask, especially not if there is a Mercury retrograde going on. So I declined, or I, not declined, I, what do you call that? I didn't approve the payment for some strange reason. And it didn't went through, but then I tried to make it go through anyway. <laughs> With skipping a step back so it looked like I had paid on the app but on the computer screen it said that <laughs> something went wrong so I had to contact uh, booking.com so they refunded the payment and then I have to do it again so again Mercury retrograde we sometimes have to redo things and something comes up where we are like, oh man, but normally I would stress out so much about it, but I was la just laughing about it. I was like, yeah, well, you know, <laughs> it's, go it's going to be fine. <laughs> and that is just for me a big sign of growth. And I actually felt myself being in gratitude instead of being worried or being like, oh no, now the money is gone. What am I going to do? What is going to happen? And it might be something that came up yesterday, something that comes up today, where you feel that there's like, this is like unknown territory, I haven't tried this before, what am I going to do? It does say with the unknown territory, you are exactly where you need to be, so you're going through exactly the lessons or the blessings that you need to go through. Follow your bliss. Beautiful, isn't it? Isn't that beautiful? Well, let's take tarot and see what this is actually going to bring you. What is this actually going to bring you? Follow your bliss today. Follow your bliss. I will just actually, let me just take one card, but I'm going to take this book for the navigating by the star. We're using the shiny tarot today. Whoa, there was cards falling. <gasps> Oh, okay, I'm going to take cards upright today. We have all these, right? First of all, four of wands, 
definitely building something that's lasting. Building something up the correct way. Preparing something in the right way. Chariot moving forward very, very fast. Something is going to happen way faster than you think. Justice is a yes card. You are ready to move forward. <laughs> yes, maybe you are um, going by car. This is like going by car. Traveling, going on a road trip today. We also have the Page of Swords, so there is also air travel, so maybe you are planning for a trip like I have been doing. We also have the Six of Cups, so soulmates are around today. For some of you guys, I like that I'm like, I'm gonna take one card. Here we are. <laughs> For some of you guys, there is a confirmation when it comes to a soulmate. Or a dream that you're following, or something with a home, with a house. You're going in the right direction, that is for sure. I do feel someone is actually having a close eye on you, what you're doing. I do feel for some of you guys, it might not be someone who is actually reaching out right now. Because I feel that there is lessons for you and lessons for them. Not negative lessons, but, but lessons where you're realizing that you are actually overcoming a lot of things and you're becoming your authentic self, you're becoming stronger. Um, in your vision, stronger in your beliefs, you're following faith, destiny, yeah, navigating by the stars. Maybe you are having crazy dreams that are also guiding you. Trust your gut, have faith that a higher power is directing your life. You know what? It's interesting because it could actually be two people, right? Because there is a masculine and feminine energy here. So you are going into unknown territory and this other person is being navigated by the stars. If you are happy in a relationship, it could be a business partner coming your way. It could be a friend, a soul tribe coming your way. It could be your goals, your dreams coming your way, obviously. But it's like two energies being connected to each other. And faith is guiding you. Both of you. Yeah, wow. Definitely. You, my friend, are being connected with someone special. If it's love, like I said, or if it's a business partner. Someone who is going to help you to the next stage of your dreams. Hmm. You might meet this person at night. Or you might meet this person when the snow is heavy on the ground. So, again, it depends on what country you are visiting. Or it depends on the season. Hmm. It could also be summer because there's a lot of yellow energy. It could be in another country, it could be close by. Hmm. That's interesting. You are being connected with someone or something. But it's like unknown territory. And it's also this energy of like you are exactly where you need to be. So maybe with Mercury retrograde, like there is changes, something is happening where you find yourself in a place where you are not supposed to be, but here you are. And it's actually exactly where you are supposed to be. That's how the universe works. It works in mysterious ways. If you are talking about zodiac signs, because I know some of you guys really want to know that, we have Cancer, we have Libra, we have Aquarius, Gemini, yeah, but again, it can be in the sun rising moon, right? It doesn't have to be the sun sign, specifically, it can be whoever, whatever. Allow your life decisions to be dic dictated by what opens your heart. And by what brings you joy? Relax, be patient, <laughs> especially in the Mercury retrograde period. Follow your bliss 
your life is divinely guided all is going according to a wonderful plan for your life be confident that all is well if that is not the last words of today <laughs> of this reading so that you can kickstart a magical day or magical night depending on when you see this yeah well i will see you guys tomorrow or later or whenever bye